Hey YouTube, what's going on? Bill here, and you're watching Plus Guys Gaming. Today, I want to hop in Dueling Book Rated Pool, and we're going to get that rating up a little bit. So let's go. But wait a minute, before I even jump into the pool, there's one thing I gotta ask. I gotta ask you to please, pretty please, tap that like button and subscribe for more content. But you know, I understand you probably don't want to do that right now. So hopefully at the end of the video, maybe you'll change your mind. Maybe you'll even ding that notification bell. But let's see, right? So let's hop into the pool. Okay, we got an opponent here. We're gonna go paper, as always. Paper wins, and we're gonna go first. Let's see what we get. We're playing Drytrons, we get Dawn Knight. Oh, I don't wanna see it. Cyber Angel Benton. Virtual spell, Fafnir, and Zeta. So two Drytrons. That's okay. Uh, I do play two ritual spells, so this Zeta is very live. It's always live, but uh, uh, it can actually search me something in this situation. You don't want to get Ash, though. Zeta first, in case he had like a hand trap or something. Search no. We don't know what he's playing. I mean, if you go by his rating, eh, who knows? Could be playing Zoo. We're gonna drop the Alpha. Now, I like Resolving Nova because it turns whatever you summon into a one card Union Carrier. And I'm going to show you how. You just go Link into Karibo. And then you just use Alpha Fetch from the Grave if he allows it. Oh, we got hit the ghost spell that sucks Ben oh we got hit with the ash okay dang man it's really like that really Rah. all right all right so we got hit with ghost bell and ash your hand must be poopy all right, let's see what we got here. We still got our normal summon. Can't go into anything. We can still ritual summon the Benton. That won't really do anything. Uh... Dang. I guess we could just set this pass. Zeta anymore, I can't use Alpha. Summon Dawn Knight. Set the Dawn Knight. Summon Dawn Knight. Link into Game Carrier. Okay, we got it. Activate. Trigger door night. No, this is bad. This is bad. This is bad. This is really bad. I mean, 
mean, it gets another uh, Drytron in gray, like, I suppose. But which one? Uh, okay. Equip something to him. for next turn you could equip uh, I was thinking another dry trial mm, okay. we'll go with another dry trial because we're not going to do anything with it this turn we can't we can't attribute it to summon gamma I wish we could but we can't we're just going to have an end of turn right here Thinking, what can possibly be in his hand? What is he playing? Zoo, virtual world, what is it? He ashed me and he bailed me. That hurt. I didn't appreciate that. Had I drawn more Drytrons, I probably could have played through it. But it is what it is. He's gonna pod desires, smash 10, draw 2. And he has 5 cards to play Yu Gi Oh! with now. But he desires first, so his hand probably was pretty bad or something. Some of the Ram Ram go into. Oh, he's going to Zeus me. Battle phase? Just like that. 400 directly to the face. I'm not going to negate it. Or is he going to attack Link Crew? But he's going to attack Link Crew. I'm going to use the effect of Link Crew. Either way, he got what he wanted. He attacked. And he's going to stack a monster, uh, stack a bunch of monsters on top of each other, and go Zeus. I don't think I should be winning this game. Oh, he's gonna do Zeus right here. Set back row. Set one back row. Ecclesia! Wow! This man has it all. Does he want to go for a Maximus play? No, he's just going to get the knighted so he can negate. I drew a Benton, which is good. But the thing is, he has an out guy right there. Now, um, I can play through this. I don't know, maybe not. He has some knights. This, it's actually, this is actually a uh, good draw. We have all four Drytrons in grief. If we get two on board, he's going to do it. That's what I feel. Um, that might be a strike set. I'm going to Zeta. Tributes. This. And if that is a strike, then he'll probably feel less inclined to strike because I just tripped to the Benton. But if he does strike, then I get to just do this again. I just get to search for the Benton and then try with a different Drytron. Okay. Let's go through. Zeta comes out. Search for the spell. Ben is 
it's good. It's a search bin. No more bin tunes left in the deck. I'm gonna try Lutionas here. People love to just do when Lutionas is targeting them on something. He probably won't though, because I just search Lutionas. Gamma tribute to Zeta? Because if I tribute to Ben and he gets rid of the Zeta, then I'm just dead. So, Gamma tribute to Zeta? And if he strikes here, then I have Ben 10. Alpha, but I just, I just didn't want to get striked by tributing Zeta. I make him want to do that. Says so okay. This man. Normal summon. Grab Natasha. I swear this guy has a hash. Can I play Yu Gi Oh? Must play like six or nine hand traps. It was just too much for me. He even has Ram Ram to do extra damage. Is he gonna use the Knight's Hit? Yes, he is. So that 100 damage I would be taking turns into a 600. Oh yeah, that's right, he can't go Dryden, ha, uh, he can't. 
can't because he used punishment. So that's why he couldn't go Trident. So now we're just worried about the Zeus. I think I can still play through this. I can Retro Summon out uh, this chick. And then he cuts me off. Gamma. Dang, whatever I summon, he's just gonna cut me off. Start your ritual spell. I mean, ritual monster. If I activate this, he's gonna Zeus. If I activate this, he's gonna Zeus. That's it. That's how you win. Everything goes. Gamma. Last card in his hand. It's a freaking hand trap. Uh, we're going to be Tionis. see why I use uh, cross sheep. I mean, I could go serve and pop it, but no, I'm not going to pop it. I, I want to take it. <laughs> I want to go cross sheep. I'm just gonna do this.
unless he has something to negate attacks. This is a game. Because this is at 53. 3k, 53. Tasha wins games. Fifty-three G G Yeah Yeah I know Yes fifty three G G What a game What a game the comeback was real. Uh, don't mind my side deck. I'm just really just... I'm testing, alright? <laughs> I, I said I was gonna side this stuff against, like, Zoo or whatever. I'm gonna side the Book of Moon. And then my back row hate because he's playing Zoo and they have back row. He's also playing Dogmatica, too. So gotta be careful. Uh, I usually side out one Herald. I side out one of these when going second. Like one of each. Just side out the redundancy stuff that you have. You know, a lot of. Uh, DD Crow in this matchup. Mitch, Chalk, and Nine. Uh, I sometimes side out Gamma, to be honest. But I don't side out my win conditions. Some people side out Ruler or Herald. I, I can't. I just can't. I could probably side in a red reboot, but he's not playing in Zoo. I mean, he's not playing Eldritch. And he has a lot of hand traps, so I'm probably, probably just going to get stopped anyways. And he would have a free trap. Um. I side Book of Moon because he goes his Dryden or his Zeus play, and I just flip it face down. I don't know, I just do it to be good. Tinky is okay. That comeback though, Natasha is amazing. But, anyways, game two. This is game two. He's going to activate Tinky, get his Doral Blade, activate the Doral Blade, which is okay. Pitching a whiptail, drawing a card. Fun fact, if you didn't know, these secondary effects of the zoo monsters, they are mandatory. So if this was uh, underneath this trident, that's a mandatory effect. So even if your opponent attacks and doesn't even say effect, it's going to get banished. You can negate it. So, as you can see, I drew Boogamoon, Nova, Alpha, Eva, Manju, and Gamma. That's three Drytrons. One, two, and three. He has four cards, and we know he plays a lot of hand traps. So, let's do it like this. First of all, book. We ain't, we ain't messing with this today. Face down. Next, we're gonna get Ash. Nah, I'd rather not. Should we just go Herald? I'd rather not get Ash. <laughs> but I, I, I guess I'd rather them Ash this than Alpha for some reason. I, I don't know. Uh, so look at look at our hand. We don't have a ritual spell. We have a way to get to a ritual spell, but we don't actually have. We don't really want to summon that. We want to summon this guy. So let's do this. I think I would say that. That kind of tells my opponent that we have a, a alpha. Sometimes it does. Sometimes, like most of the times, yeah. If we summon Zeta off Nova, we have the alpha in hand. But there are times where you just play your hand without even needing alpha. So he has Chalk and Diamond with Door Blade, so uh, we could just beat right over him. Cool.
DD Crow on the Zeta, so we can't get to our ritual spell, so which means we have to normal summon this Manju. We have to get to the ritual spell. easily uh, let's see can I set up a herald for next turn uh, gamma pitch some gamma some, uh, what's the name? alpha Honestly, thinking Zeus here to be honest. He's in the right monster zone, so I can't anima him. I can't geonator him. I, I can. Uh, I'm thinking Zeus honestly. I could go Herald, beat over him, just keep Herald here, and then I have Ava to pitch. Being over this, I am four hundred. Attack directly again. All right. Um, I'm seeing what it's. Speed over that. I swear. Did I just run into her? Okay, okay, okay. That's dead. Okay, downward. tries to like get going I could just Zeus attach these two guys I guess I could have I could have um when you encounter did alpha that Honestly, Alpha was in the wrong spot to do that. If Alpha was right here, then we get into Anima. Alpha, Tribute Gamma, Special Alpha, get a Ritual Monster like Benton for next turn. Anyways. But uh, 
uh, let me know in the comment section what I could have done. Go on, go on, go on. I'll let you go. I'll let you go. Guy, man. Summon, turn into Link Rebo, banish. Okay, do I have two banish? I really don't. Oh boy, I swear. This guy in his hand traps, he, he needs to stop that. He really does. Accidentally click and turn. Uh, normal summon. Link Rebo. Search for one? He can't manage Eva himself. And nothing else is a fairy. Banished it. It all depends on his draw. What could he have? Uh, he only drew three. Four zodiacs. Desires? I don't think. Oh, he set a card. Passed. Cyber Petit Angel. That's a good draw. That's a very good draw. I just wish I had another Dry Trine Grave. I wish I had a, the Ritual spell. Alright, so what could he have set? Here's the interesting thing. If I normally summon this, get Benton, use Gamma, tribute to Benton, summon that. How much is Hero's attack? You know what? I don't even know why we're talking. I don't know what it was, but I'm pretty sure that I could have just summoned. First of all, I was thinking Harold was a 500 attack for some reason. The only monster that would have hit my head on would be Ram Ram, uh, Ash. 
Psych Reader. I'm not sure what Bell's defense is, to be honest. But, like, they're, they're, these aren't zoo monsters. Sand card. Haha. Uh -huh. Dang. LOL. These aren't zoo monsters he's setting. It, see, Bell, I would have bumped my head. Dang, 18 defense. GG. My next card would be. Cyclone. But, um, that's the duel. 2 0. Amazing game one. I didn't even think we was going to win that. He had us down to 400 life points. Uh, and Natasha just won the game. And you, you see in the first hand the power of Natasha. That's why that's such a great card in this deck. But comment down below what you would have done differently. Comment down below any misplays that I may have done. You know, it's all about helping each other out. So just make sure to comment down below. And please, like I said earlier, tap that like button, subscribe, ding that notification bell, help us with this YouTube algorithm, get us boosted up there, more people see us. And I think that's pretty much it for me. I'm Bill from Plus Guys Gaming, turning the lights out.